Hi, this is Pat in the Hat. I'm Pat, and today I'm talking about how to set up your first bioinformatics computer. So if you're new to bioinformatics or you're just tinkering with the idea, um, this will help to get you started to install some of the tools, to um, just get familiar with the kind of analysis that we're going to be doing as a bioinformatician. So here I took a, um, I actually took an old laptop. It's a T420, Lenovo T420. And I put a Linux operating system. I, I highly suggest actually running Linux for your bioinformatics build. Um, if you don't know how to install that, I can do another video. Um, in this video, I'm just going to be showing you um, I think the easiest way to get your tools up and running in the shortest amount of time. So when you install your Linux operating system, the first thing you want to go do is go install Anaconda. So um, in my experience as a bioinformatician, the languages most commonly used are Python, R, and shell scripting or bash scripting. Um, so it's not a bad idea just to get Anaconda right out of the box. Um, so you go to this website here. You can It's available for Windows, Mac, or Linux. So obviously we just click the Linux button. I've already installed this, but it's pretty basic installation. Um, this actually comes with an installer, so um, it just kind of takes you through the setup. I know there also is a command line um, installer as well if you want to do it that way. So once you have Anaconda installed, what's really great is the Bioconda um, repository, which allows you to install all these bioinformatic tools just with a single command. So um, if you go and look at, for example, let me just bring up another one. Um, so if we wanted to install SAM tools, so SAM, SAM tools installation. You can see here, like, it's a little bit more involved. So building and installing, I mean, you have to download, you have to configure, you have to make, make, install. It's not too bad, but having Conda available is so much easier. So, for example, I'm just going to bring up my terminal. And I think I actually already ran this, but it's this right here. So it's conda install dash c bioconda. So it's just basically the dash c is just we're looking within bioconda. And you just type in same tools. Hit enter. And we'll wait here as it thinks. I already have this installed, so it shouldn't install again. While that's going, let me bring up the, the Bioconda. So, Bioconda is really great because it has all of these tools just right out of the box, easy to install, and available. So, you just have to type in, for example, if you want to install bed tools, another very commonly um, use package you just type bed tools and there you go you got it so let's check on our thing so it's already installed great so if I wanted to use SAM tools I just type in SAM tools here and here I get all the different options and I can just start running SAM tools easy as that um, let's say I want to do some de novo assembly so I'm going to install Abyss, and there it goes. So for me, this is the absolute easiest way to get up and running. Beside, when it comes to installing software, you don't want to go to multiple web pages, look at how this tool is installed, manually install it, do all that 
make install with all the paths and everything like that you just want it to work and so this is my recommendation for just making it work out of the box um, and you know you don't need a fancy computer to do this I mean uh, Linux runs on most low powered even a lot I mean this is an older laptop this laptops I think from 2010 so it runs just fine and you know it's not going to do some of the bioinformatic analysis that we need but it can do a lot of the stuff so I think this is a great way to to be introduced into bio, the world of bioinformatics and um, let me know if you have any questions or if you want to see anything else. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.